hello friends welcome back in today's video i'm going to share with you all some last month diwali decorations create a beautiful rangoli at the entrance you need not be a pro in making rangoli you can see i'm using here some tools to make this rangoli Now that actually is giving the Diwali vibe, isn't it? With this rangoli and two hanging torrents on the sides of the door and a hanging torrent on the top which is a DIY I shared recently, my entrance is ready for Diwali. Next tip is to use lots of flowers. You can use natural flowers to create such a rangoli. If you have large foyer area then you can try such poo columns in the foyer to give that festive look to your foyer. So the next tip is to use some traditional decors with flowers. Yes, you can see how beautiful this brass dia is looking at the center of this pukulam. You can give that beautiful festive look to your center table by adding some brass decor along with flowers and dias. You can see here I have used my DIY rangoli. Even on your living room corners, you can add a tray on which you can add some flowers along with your brass stickers and a dia. You can see how beautiful it looks. Here I have just used some artificial flowers and this brass decor. My foyer space is really very small so I have just used this DIY urli along with some dias. So the next step is to decorate your dining table. You can use creative ways to decorate your dining table. You can use dias, flowers, trays and some different types of candles to decorate your dining space. So here I have kept it simple, it elegant, it festive. We all hate monotony, isn't it? So use different types of dia holders at different corners of your home to give that festive yet decorative and beautiful look to your home. Even if you don't use any decorations, if you just use this one decor piece, your home is ready for Diwali. Yes, it's LED string lights. You can see the magic it has given to my home.
not only our living room is for decoration right we have to decorate our bedrooms and as well as kitchen to give it a festive look so here i have tried my best to keep my kitchen decorative as well as functional you can see i have added some rose petals in a box along with this led light to give that festive look to my kitchen We have a window in our kitchen to which I have just added this LED string lights and you can see it gives a beautiful decorative feel to my entire kitchen. As I said, get creative with your dia holders. You can see I have just used a tea glass here in which I filled some rose petals along with this tea light. Isn't it looking lovely? So the next step is to use string lights at the back of the curtains. Yes, I haven't used string lights at the back of my curtains in my living room. But in my bedrooms, I have used the string lights at the back of my curtains. that ethnic look to my bedroom i have added here gold and red to my furnishing and decor pieces have anything traditional to use as a throw so i have just used my shawl and this is a table runner which i have spread over it some traditional decor pieces in your bedroom so you can see i have just used some artificial flowers and some bangles and some decor pieces to give the traditional vibe to my bedroom so as i said using string lights at the back of the curtain has done the magic to give that festive look i have added here some traditional decor pieces on the wall This is my other bedroom which is shared by my parents and my kid so even here I have added string lights at the back of the curtains. I have done my best to keep this room organized and decorative so this is the best I could actually do. Here I have used my Benares Dupatta as a throw and you can see I wanted to add some pink elements here so I have added this uh, Dupatta which had pink border and a pink throw. And on the wall I have hung some traditional decor pieces in which some are DIYs and some are store bought ones. And here is my final tip, give a twist to your pendant lights. You can see here I have used some artificial flowers along with some hangings. These hangings are currently in trend now, the chumka and the lotus ones. So I have just hung them here to give a twist to my pendant light. And you can see it's adding that festive look to the entire space. So 
all for today's video friends i hope you guys would have got some ideas from this video i'll see you all in the next interesting video until then this is vatikani signing off have a safe and happy diwali friends